public schools have been turned into indoctrination centers, and we must rise up and say, no more. Dietrich Bonhoeffer, the great German theologian, once said, silence in the face of evil is evil itself. Friends, we are facing evil in our great nation, and we must not be silent. I'm Todd Stern. From the 24-7 KXL newsroom, I'm with Cindy Kane. A judge will wait to decide how much a 15-year-old will have to pay for starting the Eagle Creek fire. Victims have requested a total of $37 million. The judge in Hood River says he'll decide by next week. Deputies arrested the woman suspected of shooting the man in Beaverton last week. She's 15 and from Vancouver. KXL's Jim Ferretti asked deputies about the connection. Are detectives investigating if this young lady was a victim of sex trafficking? At this point, they're investigating all possibilities. Washington County deputies say she met the 56-year-old man online and was at his Sexton Mountain home at the time of the shooting. Detectives say she may also be involved in a home invasion robbery in Camas. The man is recovering. Freedom 970 weather. A bit cloudy today and around 71 degrees. We'll have sunshine tomorrow afternoon and 74. The weekend brings a real mix of sun and clouds, but highs should be in the mid-70s. Next week, we can look forward to some high 80s. From the 24-7 KXL Newsroom, I'm Lisa McKay on Freedom 970. At B. Young RV, spring is in the air. You can save thousands with the best selection in the land and special pricing at the Northwest Premier RV Dealer. Get into B. Young RV and get ready for spring. Hey, homeowners, listen up. Interest rates are rising and experts just continue to rise. So you need to seriously think about refinancing now before rates go up more. The longer you wait, the more interest you might pay. So if you even thought about pulling cash out of the equity in your home to pay off credit cards, car loans, or purchase an investment property, you need to make the cash call now at 855-875-CASH before mortgage rates rise anymore. Cash Call Mortgage can still refinance your loan at a low fixed interest rate for a flat fee of just $995 and will pay all third-party closing costs. Call 855-875-CASH today to begin the quick and easy process. We close most loans in less than 21 days to get you the cash you need fast. That's 855-875-CASH. First Mortgages, Impact Mortgage Corp, DBA, Cash Call Mortgage, One City Boulevard, Orange, California, 92868, NMLS, 122231. Equal housing lender, not licensed in all states, including New York. Call 855-657-9910 for licensing terms, conditions, and restrictions. That's 855-875-CASH. Every business needs great people, and the better way to find them. Something better than posting your job online and just praying for the right people to see it. The ZipRecruiter revolutionized hiring. Their technology finds great candidates for you. No wonder 80% of employers who post a job on ZipRecruiter get a quality candidate through the site in just one day. Goodbye, post and pray. Hello, ZipRecruiter, the smartest way to hire. Try it for free today at ZipRecruiter.com slash free. That's ZipRecruiter.com slash free. Are you sick and tired of being sick and tired? Wouldn't you rather be healthy, energetic, and fit? I'm Dennis Black. Ten years ago, I developed a Texas-sized solution to America's health crisis. I make my Texas superfood from 55 raw, vine-ripened fruits and vegetables. I lost 60 pounds. I mean, that's huge. Since I've been on superfood, I haven't been sick. It's shocking how much energy I have. Join us on TexasSuperfood.com. TexasSuperfood.com. Or call 877-55-TEXAS. That's 877-55-TEXAS. TCB Tossing and Perform. You know what tough work looks like. So does the crew at High Caliber Mill Rides. They understand tough. Get your job done right the first time. High Caliber. A reputation you can trust. 360-984-6669.
Trump campaign, who was spying, our own government was spying on a presidential candidate. We now know that. It's not front page news because they don't want you to know that, but that's what we learned from a leak reported to the New York Times. We know there's been a lot of lies going on. We know that uh, when our two of our agents went overseas went to London, they in they interviewed the Australian ambassador and we know that that broke diplomatic protocol so someone high up the chain had probably you can guess we don't know for sure maybe someone like uh, John Kerry the Secretary of State approved that so had to know this was going on.